Controversy tonight over a gubernatorial nomination. Acting Education Commissioner Christopher Cerf is trying to stay above the fray, but State Senator Ron Rice of Newark says he's invoking senatorial courtesy to block Cerf's nomination until he's satisfied the governor's nominee will be good for the Newark schools. Senior political correspondent Michael Aaron reports. There are too many issues starting to come to surface uh, relating to Mr. Cerf. And we have to look at this a little bit deeper before I signed off. Senator Rice is concerned about Surf's relationship with the Newark School District. The acting commissioner addressed the Black Minister's Council in Newark this morning. Last week, it was reported that his partner in a consulting firm won a half million dollar contract from Newark to rethink the school system there. Rice says that money came from a private hedge fund manager and that privatization of Newark schools is meant to suck money out of the public school system, and that that's why Rice is blocking Surf. NJN's Marie Denoya Aronson caught up with Surf after his morning speech. I, I have the highest regard for Senator Rice. I consider him a, a, a decent and honorable man. We've had uh, honest, direct, and forthright conversations, uh, and that's really all I have to say. Surf was invited to appear yesterday before the legislature's Joint Committee on the Public Schools, chaired by Ron Rice. Senate President Steve Sweeney stopped that from happening, saying that acting commissioners must go before the Senate Judiciary Committee first for a confirmation hearing before any other committee, as Sweeney explained at a taping today for this Sunday morning's On the Record program. Senator Rice has his right to feel strongly where he's at. And I respect Senator Rice's position. Hopefully, they'll work out their differences. Uh, the administration can get the uh, the acting commissioner sitting down with Senator Rice so he can get his questions answered, where he can be comfortable, so we can advance through the Judiciary Committee. But any acting commissioner has to go through Judiciary. Surf told the Black Minister's Conference, urban schools need a structural overhaul. Rice would still like Surf to appear before his committee first. But the reality, Mike, is that until I sign off, you know, he's not going to be confirmed to be a commissioner. And with this most recent stuff popping up and other calls I'm starting to get, um, what's going to happen is I'm not really in a mode to sign off right away until I can do further investigation um, on the individual and the relationships um, surrounding him. There's obviously a discussion going on within the state Senate that is that I'm not part, that I am not part of and uh, I um, look forward to the day when they're able to work things out. Are you troubled at all by what you've seen about surf? It's, it's starting to raise questions. You know what I mean when we first heard of his nomination you know I think people were pretty excited because he had a great reputation coming out of New York City and uh, but the relationship with Newark is at least starting to have people have questions now that weren't there before, Michael. Michael Aaron, NJN News, Trenton.